Myra cheated on I did not cheat on you. Hola, babies. It's me. So for today's YouTube video, I'm bringing you guys something new and different. And I'm going to suffer. And my brother's going to suffer. And Jay's going to suffer. So basically, what we're doing is last to leave the trampoline wins. So basically, we're just gonna stay in the trampoline. Um, we can't leave to use the restroom. We can't leave to eat. And yeah, it's gonna be bad, but funny for you guys. So yep, let's just jump right into the video. Choose your But I think it's enough for me to stay in here for a long time. I brought my pillow just in case it gets nighttime, and I brought my blanket so I don't get cold, and I brought my dog just in case I get bored, and yeah. Pretty come on. All right, so I have the blanket. Obviously, if I get cold at night, because I know I'm making it at night, and then this ball, because just in case if I'm bored, I like to catch. This is something I can piss in, and I got my fruit snacks with me because you know I'm a hungry bun. That's you know disgusting. Why do you put the fruit snacks in your pee bucket? Shut the fuck up. I mean. I mean, love you guys. So I got some popcorn. Badass. Know, so I came here prepared, like prepared, prepared. All these people, they just came with blankets and pillows, you know? So I got the popcorn, right? You know, I got a bowl and everything. Nice, fresh, cold Coca Cola, you know? And then. What's that? What's that you got there? Oh, yeah. Oh, let me get Why do you have a pink pillow? And then I have some fruit snacks, you know? Some Oreos, you already know prepared and my blanket so I'm pretty much good at it. probably gonna win if I'm being completely honest, I do think that Jay's gonna win just because he has more supplies. He has the pillows and the food, but I like promised myself I wasn't gonna get hungry. But then again, Jay has nothing to use if he has to use the bathroom. Betty did bring his pee bucket. The can? The can? Ew, Jay says he's using the can. I don't know what I'm gonna do, but hopefully I win because guys, remember, we're betting $300 and nobody wants to lose 300. Okay, bye. Uh, this is the update right now. His fat ass is still I eating. I am so bored. There's nothing to do. Max like looks like he's chilling right now. And I'm just recording because I'm bored out, out of my mind. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, uh, okay, guys. So, Fetty just thought of something genius. We're going to do like little challenges. Like, whoever stops jumping first or who can hold their, like, how do you say it? Who can hold their balance? Yeah, like something like little challenges like that. And whoever the winner is has one minute to run inside and get whatever they want. But they have one minute. And if they don't make it back in one minute, they can't come back in the trampoline. We do a challenge every hour. Yeah, we're gonna do a challenge every hour. Yeah. You guys best be knowing what I'm gonna grab is something to drink because I'm thirsty. Best believe you know I'm winning. Head out gang, you know what I'm saying? Ah! <laughs> okay, guys, for real, three hundred dollars. Whoever is the last one to get out, bet on it. Betty bet on it, three hundred dollars. You know. Look at Max. <laughs> What's wrong with Max? Look at him. Look at Max. <laughs> Why is he opening his jaw so much? Look at him. Look. <laughs> what to do? What to do? What to do? I'm thirsty and I have to go to the yeah. bathroom. Okay, throw it. Throw some. Oh, fuck. <laughs> You're nasty. So, my sister came in here. She made us a little company. Oh my god. I really hope this comes off. Oh, she kicked you with her foot, damn. Yeah. Yeah. Look at this alien ass boy. Yeah. Oh shit. Oh shit. Yeah. Stop! Damn. Ow. Guys, stop! I accidentally Ow. sat on one. Ow. Oh. Get 
no, no. <laughs> what is that face he's making? <laughs> so now it's my turn to say my side of the story for story time so basically this is the story about my cheating on me and me finding out about it. i did not cheat on this you. is my video stop, i didn't stop cheat it on start it recording i me. did not cheat on you everything started was when we had a small little argument like every relationship has you know and so basically she was like you know what let's break up let's do this let's that so i was like you know what whatever fine because I, I was i've been sick and tired of the way myra's been treating me so i was like you know what fine like it's cool then we'll just break up then so she was the one who suggested to break up so i was like okay cool so i grabbed all my stuff from her house i put it in my bag and i was about ready to go and she deleted all her tick all the tiktoks we did together in front of me the next day um but we decided to go get Myra's nails done. So we went to go get Myra's nails done, right? And so, like, obviously my phone is broken. I can't use it. Um, so I don't have a phone. So while Myra was getting her nails done, she obviously let me use her phone because, you know, I was going to get bored. So I was just on her phone playing games. And then I went to TikTok, scroll through TikTok for a bit. Then I go to Instagram. So I go to Instagram and I go to her, her message, her, like, inbox or whatever, her DMs. And I see this uh, one person. It was like I seen like East East Side Dan or something like that, and I clicked on it. And I forgot what it said, but it was just like him texting. And I was like, Myra, who's this? And she's like, Ooh, that's <laughs> basically we find that out. And I decided to leave the nail salon, and Myra stays there. And I sit outside because I just needed some fresh air because this was a lot to take in because. That's her ex that she dated for two years, and I find out they were texting. I only saw his message because Myra, I guess she deleted the messages, and I guess he texted back, and that's the only reason why I saw the messages. Otherwise, I wouldn't have seen it because Myra deleted them because she was trying to cheat, but she couldn't. And so basically, um, I find that out, and she apologizes to me, and she's just sorry, and then I was really angry, and she had a talk with me and she told me that she's really really sorry and that she wouldn't uh do anything to to sacrifice a relationship because i guess i'm a good boyfriend and she really loves me and that um, she realizes that it was wrong what she did and um basically i forgave her and the next day i was on her phone again so like i just did the usual and at this point i don't i didn't my trust for her was at like 25 percent so like i went to go check her instagram again to see her dms and there wasn't anything there and then like i was proud of her for that because like then I, she really did keep her eggs blocked but then i just out of luck i just swiped down and you know how when you swipe down like from the bottom of your phone you see all the notifications that pop up this was after yesterday when Myra told me that she wasn't gonna ever text them again she promised never to text them again and that she was not gonna do anything to sacrifice her relationship because she knows that she's in a good relationship now and she basically bullshitted me and lied to me lied and she texted him again behind my back and I That's found out and at that point I didn't know what to think because like she promised me that she wasn't ever gonna do it again and that she wouldn't do anything to sacrifice a relationship and she still did it and at that point I kind of wanted to break up with her but you know when you love someone it's kind of hard to do that so I um, I decided just to forgive her and I don't know if I'm dumb for that or if I'm good but to be honest to be honest, in my like point of view, I still think she's texting him. I still think she's FaceTiming him. And um, because it's so easy for her to just to text them and then delete it. Obviously, I don't have a phone, so I can't see if she would to text them. But 
obviously it's easy for her to text him and then the next day when I come over she can just delete the messages and it'd be like nothing would ever happen and Myra tells that she still loves him and that she's confused this might have been not a mistake it was a choice like I said I'm gonna own up to what I did but like I said I never regretted nothing more in my life and I do regret it and I don't care how many times Jay says I don't love him I honestly love him to death and I am not texting him anymore whatsoever it probably is it's easy for you to delete it like you did last time you just forgot to clear your notifications no because you slept over the other day and you didn't hear me talking on the phone did you but like I said guys I own up to my my decisions and it's not happening again I still love him, honestly, obviously, and that's it. Skittle gang. But yeah, all right. Stop! Right. Keep recording. Keep recording. Okay. Skittle gang. Okay, guys, we're doing our first challenge. Whoever's the winner gets to get out of the trampoline for one minute to I'll grab lose. supplies. The challenge is whoever stops jumping first loses. <laughs> Set. Go. Okay, so I'm just looking at the cameras now, and it was a draw. Basically, both of them stopped jumping at the same time. So I'm gonna be a nice person, and I'm gonna let both of them go inside the house to get something for a minute. Woo! So let's see what they get. Jay legit has 15 seconds left. Fetty, what did you grab? I grabbed more cover with blankets. It's over. I grabbed- You have 10 seconds left. I grabbed my pillow, and I grabbed a jacket just in case. What did you grab, Jay? A speaker. Jay legit brought a speaker. How is that gonna help you survive at night? We're gonna freeze, Jay. Yeah, Okay, so basically, Jay couldn't find out what he couldn't find what he wanted, which is like like unfair. So I'm gonna go find it for him, but they're only gonna give me a minute. So I'm gonna risk losing for my baby. Okay, so what you thinking? What's your thoughts, Betty? Uh, Mara's slow, so I think she's not gonna make it. She gave herself another 15 seconds because she's a cheater like that and there's mosquitoes all over the place. You know, we're actually kind of slow because it tells you how long you've been recording, so we really didn't even need a timer. I didn't, I just realized it right now. Huh? 30 seconds. No. <laughs> Say you want someone. Say you want someone Keep up with these hoes cause they messy Go bitch, go bitch, go bestie Can't fuck with these hoes cause they messy Go bestie Then my motherfucking best friend go bestie Then my motherfucking best friend <laughs> <laughs> What time is it? I made it at 9 o'clock So guys, it is currently 9 o'clock We're all tired and we all want to go inside and just eat But we can't Why are you tired? <laughs> It's been so long. Uh, it's pitch dark. 
and our mom is gonna give us food at Burger King. And I'm so tired, bored as hell. And oh, it's so bad. I just wanna leave, but it's just me and Myra. And it's like, oh my god. Look at Myra, she's so exhausted. Like, mama! Bro, it's like 30 degrees out here. Guys, it's freezing. There's mosquitoes. I have mosquito bites all over. I haven't took a shower. I feel dirty. That's probably why you <laughs> <laughs> uh, But my mom brought us Burger King, so we're gonna eat like late as hell, though. It's like 30 degrees out <laughs> My mom's the plug! Bye bye. Oh, oh, oh. She's throwing the sauces at us. Ma, did you do um 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 a plain cheeseburger? Thank you, ma. Where's Love you, ma. So my mom was the plug, and she got us the Burger plug, King. What? The plug. The plug. We're, We're, not We're literally oh, eating at 9:30. How was it, baby? Mm. It's good. Hot. It's hot. Ugh. You don't like the chicken nuggets? What did you get, Fetty? Is there hair? There's like a really. There's a hair and a really hard part. <laughs> <laughs> Not with the plug. This this food is trash. Burger King exposed your. Okay, Fetty, what are you getting? I got a plain cheeseburger and some trashy chicken nuggets and there was a freaking hair in it. If we're not going to finish that, I will. So, I got 10 piece chicken nuggets. I feel like this is going to be enough. But my mom didn't get us any soda, so we're going to die of thirst, honestly. Oh my God. We love a boyfriend who watches my TikToks at night. What are you talking about, rate every... Rate it one through ten. I'm still eating my chicken nuggets. You're gonna see ten forever, Buffalo like, sauce. Like, that's like a fox. Currently, it's ten o'clock, and we're watching Ralph Breaks the Internet. Okay guys, we're gonna try to get some sleep because none of us left, none of us wanted to get out of the trampoline. We're all very determined. So we're sleeping here, I think. Uh, we're gonna try to get some sleep and see who leaves first thing in the morning. Who knows?